Hi everyone, welcome to Naresh Technologies. This is Srinivas. In this session, is we are going to discuss how to print all the strong numbers in the given limit using C program. Here it is the program is the printing strong numbers in the given range. So, we know that how to check one given number is a strong number or not in the previous video sessions already we discussed right just once go through that video and check this one. So, first here it is I am writing the logic that how to check one number the one number is a strong number or not right. Suppose execution starts from the main function here it is now we are not not reading only one number we are reading the limit in the limit how many strong numbers are there we are checking we are reading that limit in place of read you can write a printf and scanf function I am not writing all. So, first of all so one number is a strong number or not for example n value is a 145. So, strong number means what uh, individual digits factorials is equals to the same number sum. So, 1 plus 24 plus 120 the value is a 145 if both are equal it is a strong number it is a strong. So, how to write the logic see for example, here it is a we are declaring suppose n value is a 145, 145 and a sum value because we are adding every time after finding that uh, factorial value. First we need to get individual digit while n value is greater than 0 digit by digit we have to collect suppose in the 145 the first of digit we need to get. So, last digit how you will get? r equals to n mod 10. If you perform mod operation with a 10, you will get the last digit suppose 5 and then find the factorial for that 5. How to find the factorial? So, declare one variable fact is equals to 1 and here with the help of loop, we know how to find the factorial. r value, r factorial we need to find out. So, i value starts from r, i is greater than or equals to 1, i minus minus this is finding the factorial fact is equals to fact into i is finding the factorial. After finding the factorial the value we are adding to the sum suppose 120 the so 120 we are adding to sum sum equals to sum equals to sum plus fact sum is equals to sum plus fact that is the 5 factorial value 120 we are adding to the sum. Next we need to work with a 4 how you will get 14 means what we are performing n is equals to n by 10 operation we know that n by 10 operation we need to find out and here it is you will get 14 and here it is a 14 again the same uh, loop executes here it is n mod 10 means what it will give that 4 and next with the help of this one 4 factorial we are finding it is a 24 24 we are adding to sum. And next uh, n by 10 means what it will give that 1 and here it is a 1 factorial we are finding and we are adding. So, this is how to check whether the number is a is a strong number or not. Finally, if number is a if n is a strong n value is equals to sum it is a strong number like that we are writing if if n value equals to sum sum is a printf it is a strong number what is that n is a strong number clearly percentage d is strong in that place we are writing that n value n value now so this is the concept this is the logic to only check whether the one number given number n is a strong or not but now here it is not checking one number we are checking all the numbers in the limit so this logic the entire logic the entire logic one number logic we are writing in the loop and here it is n value starts with 1 to n is less than or equals to limit and here it is a n plus plus like that we have written. Now observe first n value is a 1 the so, 1 is less than or equal to suppose limit is a 100 consider right here it is n value 1 the control move inside and it will check that 1 is a strong number or not. If it is a strong number with this logic it will execute and it will print that one strong number. Next n value become 2 and it will check 2 is a strong number or not. Next n value 3 like that it will go up to 100 it will check. How many strong numbers are there between 1 to 100? So, with the help of this one 
it will print first we should know how to check one number is a strong number or not and then the entire logic we need to place inside a for loop and what are the variables we are using here r we are using n we are using fact we are using sum we are using all these variables we need to declare and of course i we are using to find the factorial so this is the program that how to print how to display all the strong numbers in the given range hope you understood for more videos please subscribe to narishati channel thank you